When cleaning a pitch and encountering a pendulum, there are a few ways to accomplish this technical move. At first, the task may seem daunting, but with practice, it should become second nature. Let's outline this step by step, as it is imperative you do this right or you will be really confused. And be sure to practice these techniques at your local crag prior to attempting them 1,000 feet off the deck. First, approach the pendulum point, which is usually a fixed piece of gear, such as a piton, and will contain either a carabiner or some scary looking tattered piece of webbing. If you don't like what is there to lower from, now is the time to make it something you trust via your extra webbing or a lever beaner. So as I approach the piece the pendulum off of, I'm gonna stop a little ways below it. I'm gonna grab a lock and carabiner and clip it to my belay loop right here, okay? Next thing I'm gonna do is grab the rope below my tie-in knot. I'm gonna stand up, this will take a little bit of balance to do. If it's hard, you can always clip a quick draw into your belay loop as well. You can stand up and just clip yourself in temporarily to the bottom of your Jumar so you can reach this easier. Next, I'm gonna pass this rope that I grabbed below my knot through the piece of cord up here. Pull this bite and clip it into the locking carabiner that I put on my harness right here. Okay, go ahead and lock the carabiner. And then I'm gonna grab the end of the rope and slack it in and pull tight on that so that it takes my weight. Once I do that, the Jumar should come free. Go ahead and pass that one. Better get this quick draw out of here, I'm short now. Okay, I can clip that on, take my weight up on this, and now this rope comes slack. Remove this carabiner from the anchor. I like to slide this up as tight as I can before I head over. I get myself nice and tight there, both Jumars. Now I'm just going to use this like I'm repelling, lower myself out off the piece. And I'm going to pull on the rope below my knot. It's going to allow me to retrieve my rope, leaving nothing at the bolt over here. After I pulled my rope free and I'm finished with my pendulum, before I continue upwards to clean, I'm going to go ahead and grab the rope and tie another overhand or figure eight on a bite to back myself up again once I'm complete. Now I can start cleaning the pitch. These are essential techniques to any big wall and aid climbing adventure. Be sure to practice and have a working understanding of these systems before venturing onward. 